everyone uh, in this video we're going to go over how to create or how to generate topology which is how to turn a plane into a screen or a partition with openings in, uh, in a specific pattern from the patterns that you already have in 3d max so i'll just go to the top of view at the beginning and i'm going to create a plane and I'm going to create the dimensions that I want for this partition. So let's say that I want the length to be 3000. Uh, by the way, you can do this from the front view. This is up to you. And then let's say the width is going to be two meters. So I have this now and I'm going to increase the number of segments according to the segments that you want. Now, just keep in mind, the more segments you have, the smaller the pattern will be. So again, you can just try it first and then you can control the number of segments according to the desired design that you want. Then I'm going to have to change this to editable poly. And then after that, I'm going to go to press number four to activate polygon selection. Okay, so just click on four and then control A to select all of these polygons. Now you will see here, we're having, uh, we have the modeling tab in here. Now, if this is minimized like this, you can just click on it and it's going to maximize. It's gonna take a bit of time, but then you're going to find the modifications or some of the uh, settings that we already have in here, but we have even more settings here at the top. So I'm just going to go to modeling polygon modeling and then generate topology now when you click on that you're going to have these patterns to choose from so let's say i'm going to select this pattern you will see that now the objects already changed or the uh, polygons that we have changed to the model to the pattern that we have let's just go back let's say i'll select this and when you click on it again it's going to make the pattern even bigger and it will remove some of the uh, lines but this is going to create to create a few problems so i prefer that you change the number of the segments from the beginning and then you can go over these patterns that you have here okay so let's say i'm going to select this now we have the pattern already created you can close this one and you can continue working in here Depending on what you want to create, you can select the polygons that you want. Now, I've already selected all of them. I will go here to inset, maybe. And then I'm going to increase the inset value from here. And I will change the type and instead of uh, group to one by one or individual, okay, by polygon. Then you can increase or decrease depending on how much you want the thickness to be. Let's say I want them to be this way. So let's maybe say five and then I will click on OK. Now you can delete these new polygons that are already selected. So you have this type of partition. Then you can select all of the polygons again and you can extrude them so you can have a thickness. So let's say I'll keep it as 50 maybe. OK, and then I'll click on OK. And now you have this partition that is created very fast, no time, no effort needed to create it.